Hello, I'm Dr. Azhar Alam and today we'll discuss about jaundice and gallbladder stones. So the first question is, is jaundice commonly associated with gallbladder stones? The answer is no. Normally jaundice is not associated with gallbladder stones. So before we discuss, there are two settings. One, jaundice in patients with gallstones before surgery and jaundice after gallstone surgery. So if a patient has gall gallbladder stones, who has not yet undergone surgery and is suffering from jaundice, there can be a few conditions. Number one, along with gallbladder stones, the patient may have common bile duct stones. How do you evaluate? You do an MR MRCP. Another condition in which along with gallstones, jaundice can be present is a condition known as Miridzi syndrome. So this is a condition in which it is a complicated gallbladder and gallbladder is seen very adjacent to the bile duct with inflammation. What is the investigation? Again, you do an MRCP. And the thirdly, which is a slightly rare condition, but it is still seen as gallbladder cancer. So there are conditions in which gallbladder cancer is present along with gallbladder stones and this gallbladder cancer can result in jaundice. So if a patient has jaundice before surgery and has gallbladder stones, you need an MRCP to find out what the reason for jaundice is because normally jaundice is not common if you have a simple uncomplicated gallbladder stone disease. The next setting is you have undergone surgery for gallbladder stones. Now you have jaundice. What can be the cause? The most common cause is slipping of a small stone or sludge into the common bile duct. So if after your gallstone surgery you have jaundice, one of the common reasons is because a small stone or sludge is seen in the common bile duct. The second and a much more dangerous condition is biliary injury. That means at the time of your surgery, due to some reason, there has been an injury to the bile duct or to some of the surrounding structures. This can result in jaundice and this is a serious issue. Because in case you have jaundice because of any injury, the procedure afterwards is a very long and troublesome procedure. Recently, we had a case of a 50-year-old female who had undergone a gallstone surgery at a nursing home in one of the peripheral hospitals. She presented with jaundice three months after the surgery. We did a complete evaluation and we saw a major biliary injury. She had to undergo another repeat surgery. I did the surgery. The procedure is known as a hepatico jejunostomy in which we all together create a new route for the passage of bile. So it is a very long procedure. It is a very complicated and a very skilled procedure. These do happen in some cases. In case they do happen, you will need a suggestion or treatment from a specialist or a hepatobiliary surgeon. But the best thing is to get evaluated preoperatively, get your gallstone disease treated by someone who is skilled and at a good setup because that will help you prevent complications. Thank you.